Hi guys, it's me, Malcolm, the movie Wizard of Oz himself, and I'm here to discuss a review that I was about to do it around Black History Month, but damn, I was too late to do it, but what the hell, I'm here to do it right now. Get out. Yes, get out. This movie was an original it was so it had a it was so grimly tense and it's in tune within within its time oh i must say though it was it was crazy at first it started normal how how we have the protagonist chris and his girlfriend rose going going to spend a weekend with her parents they were okay though, and you know, and the brother was kind of was kind of a jerk, but that was normal. But that all changed until something sinister went down. I mean, when we saw saw the pictures pictures of Rose with other black men, then that means something wicked. This way comes. I must say though, but but it was a big shocker that Rose was part of it the whole time. Oh my god! But then again, when it comes to horror movies, movies they weren't they they are not too shy of revealing the victims. Revealing the victims or the easy on the eyes, you know what I mean? Kind of characters who are really the bad guys. Bad guys. Like, like in Scream, how Matthew Lillard's character was one of the killers. It's a monster. Or how in Screen 4, how, oh, Jill, Jill played by Emma Roberts, who, who was, who was one of the villains the whole time. That bitch was so jealous of Sydney. She was just like Jan Brady. But enough about that. I really do admire it. I mean, the second place, place where Chris went to, it was out of this world. It was like he was falling down a rabbit hole that was so bottomless. Weird. But I do admire how he finally fought back against that family and killed them one by one. He was one badass mofo right there. Hands down. Oh, Lord. Crazy. I, but it's, boy, I was so amazed of what happened here in the plot of this movie. Everyone wants to be immortal these days just by transferring one consciousness into another. I really find it quite, quite basically racist how they pick black people to take over. Okay, guys. So, for my score for Get Out, I do believe Jordan Peele did an extraordinary, awesome horror movie. Movie. I didn't expect nothing from from a comedian from Key and Pill. Pill. So I think I'll give this one a t uh, nine. Definitely a nine. 
Okay, you guys, I guess that's it. If you like this video, like, like, comment, subscribe, and be sure you all stay safe, stay healthy, and wear a mask. Bye. You see the gloves are coming off Tell me when you've had enough Yeah Ready for a showdown And we're face to face I think I'll rearrange it Put you in your place You don't get the best of me Checking you're afraid of me I'm stuck in your head